It has been forever since we dared to touch Mario Kart Wii Item Rain again. Last time we played, a Sugar Scoot won the entire tournament series, and that proved that anything was possible on this game mode. So we are back for more excitement. 32 custom tracks, 12 players, 8 races per GP, 2 eliminations GP1, 4 eliminations GP2 and 3, and a 1v1 in the finals. Bonus items are active once again and awarded every 30 points. Let the madness ensue. It has been a while since we played Item Rain, but I am so excited to be back you know, kind of overdid it during the 10 day tournament series. And now since it's been quite some time, I feel like it's time for a W. We're only going home with first today and it is gonna be a very difficult tournament considering, you know, this first GP hopefully is like warm up. Oh my God, frames dropping like crazy. Back to item rain, welcome back. <laughs> item rain has given me a nice greeting already. But anyway, it's only two eliminations for the first GP and then four for the next two. Those are gonna be terrifying. And then the finals has to be two people for this GP KO mode. But we're uh, gonna do some more videos with this KO mode. I really like the idea of having the bonus items accumulate over the GPs. Having the scores reset, but the bonus is not, is really helpful. Uh, the only downside with this type of tournament is if disconnections happen, there's no way to get the players back into the room. You know, old technology here with the Nintendo Wii. Yes, got the Mega. There's Machutino using the Blue Falcon. Insane. You can change your vehicle every eight races. Oh, I got it. So, you know, eight race GPs. Gonna be quite a bit of time before we even have any eliminations. Gonna be quite a bit different than what you guys are used to watching on the tournament series on the regular. And wow, this is so much lag. And you know what? We haven't played Item Rain in a while. I just remembered that Rock Rock Ridge was a track that we had to avoid. I did not remember this one lagging this badly. And just like that, I got hit by lag. I really, really got hit badly there. I'm in the middle of the pack. There's four racers that are pretty far behind, so it's not a terrible situation, but not where I want to be ideally. It is hard to see the items on this track. And how it'll be is, assuming we make it to the back half of the tournament, that will only be six people, and six people Adam Rain actually has 60 FPS. It's gonna be really smooth. So that's something to look forward to, potentially. I think that shock, low key, kind of saved me from getting hit. It was a good shock, and I was able to get the shock. And oh, mushroom did not get me up there in time. Still in a really good spot here. Those fishies can't hurt you. I've learned that the hard way. Matutino! Okay, okay. Gonna get away from the Mega Mushroom. Hopefully no bombs here, like last lap. Machutino is lagging, hopefully it doesn't Mega me. Don't wanna get bombed, terrifying. All right, we are getting sixth, sixth place, which is not too bad. L gets the W on the first race. Pretty cool, pretty ironic. I can't imagine we're gonna have a single track lag as badly as Rosalina's Ice World. So we should be in the clear, hopefully, and that's just item rain in general. It's never gonna run completely perfectly. But I know on the Super Nintendo tracks and the GBA tracks, which we have plenty of today, I I think I think we'll be okay. Machutino stole the Mega Mushroom in the grass. I was going for it. Machutino just one step ahead on the Blue Falcon, making it happen. We need this bullet though. And fifth place bullet is amazing. This bullet should last a long time. I want a five out of five Uber right now. Yes. Yes! 33 second dodge. That's a $20 tip on top. That was an amazing Uber. All right, not going for the trap box. Gonna grab these instead and go for the shortcut with the pow block, perfect! And what a start to this race. I'm just gonna go around. I don't think I have enough speed to clear that on 150cc. And we have a mushroom in first. And we're getting fake item blocks because I look back, see the blue shell, and I can't dodge, and now everything is just terrible. And look at these top two right now. Top two blue falcon. Are they about this would be the coolest top two of all time. Machutino steals my box. Machutino just ruining my race out here once again. Don't want to get hit. Don't want to get hit. All right. Let's get the mega mushroom. Let's dodge. Let's go. <laughs> no, I was going to run away with it right there. Okay, well, now we have to fight for it for real. This is craziness. That bullet almost landed right on me. Terrifying. Gotta get away from everyone. We got the mushroom. The bullet was too hard to get to. I 
I think I got third. It might have been a top two Blue Falcon. I'm not kidding. I cannot wait to see how this shakes out. Okay, I got second place. I actually am the one who ruined the Blue Falcon dream. But hey, one in three with the Blue Falcon, you don't see that every day. Here it is, Banish Keep. I know this one so well in one, like on 200, but I don't think I have the shortcuts down 150. I really don't think I want to try anything too risky. But if I get a bullet bill, maybe we'll go for some risky business. We shall see. Mpex with the shortcut takes the early lead. And I mean, Mpex is on the spear, which is so exciting. We have some really goofy combos. And I mean, hey, it's the first GP, it makes sense. And I don't blame everyone here for wanting to, uh, Get a little crazy at the beginning, because next GP is going to be a whole lot harder. I think we'll see a lot more Mock Bike and Quacker. Maybe some Bullet Bike. I mean, the Flame Runner is pretty good on item range, too. I've thought about using the Flame Runner. It's a little bit difficult. Yes! Got the dodge. Oh my gosh, the star split, and we both dodged. Top two breakaway, double dodge! Oh my gosh, that's crazy. A quadruple shock dodge between myself and Normie from from one star, one ground star. Alright. The bullet bill! Oh, I missed it by pixels! That's so frustrating. That's so frustrating, guys. Alright, we'll mushroom it first. I'm gonna keep looking forward. And keep getting mushrooms? Yes, another mushroom. It's a little bit risky to chain that, but we're good, we're good, we're good. And I'm getting the shock as I get shocked, so there's another shock, and I see a uh, Dry Bones and a Baby Mario right on my tail, and there goes the Mega Mushroom, and there goes the star. All of the good items are disappearing right in front of my eyes, and I have been small for forever. There goes my entire lead. We need another shock, like right now. Wait, whoa, whoa, what was that? Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> but there's Mpex, of course. So careful on this one. All right, we're both doing shortcut, and I'm landing right on a bomb. That is so unfortunate. I did not even see that until I tricked. Just happened to aim for the worst possible spot. I'm gonna slow down so I don't get mega mushroomed here. Okay, we are not going for a shortcut, but we are gonna benefit so much from that shock right now. Yes, incredible second place we know who's in first mpex has a breakaway i think this will be worth it there's gonna be a shock i'm predicting there's so many shocks happening there with the mushroom i don't even want to go for shortcut but gotta go for it anyway and just like that we're in second I'm so scared to go for shortcuts with only one mushroom because you never know when something bad's gonna happen in item range. You'd be stuck in the off road forever. Oh! We're in first! This is the craziest banish keep race I've played in quite some time. I'm getting past my Machutino now. Why did the bomb have to land on me? Unbelievable. I'm so focused on the front of the road. I didn't even hit that mushroom. Come on, come on. Why did I not get that? Okay, this is a good respawn. I still got fifth. I think I still got fifth. Why did I not get that? Oh, maybe it's because I'm Bowser Jr. and not Daisy. And if that's the case, I'm really sad because I like using Bowser Jr. But I felt like I got the wheelie and... Maybe it was like the pal made me shake and I didn't get enough height. Such a weird race. Only ended up getting 6th place, but it's okay because we have 24 overall and we need 6 more points to get a bonus because it's 30 points per bonus. 120 points total is the max you get in a GP. 4 is the most amount of bonuses you can store, so we still need to get just one. An incredibly tough first GP considering we have almost entirely retro tracks available for the selection, so pretty crazy. So let's see how this goes with Engine Labs item rain. Oh, missed that. Wish I would've got that. Let's not get hit by the bullet. That's good. And we have the cannon jump coming soon. Let's not get bulleted. Very close. And I love how it's a trickable cannon. Very helpful. And extremely 
tough if you don't know about it, because you lose so much time not tricking in this game. And there's no boost afterwards. Oh, oh! Uh oh, I was really afraid that was gonna happen. All right, we're playing this one from the back, I guess. I see a star, I'm not gonna be able to get to that. Let's avoid all the ground blue shell. I just missed that, I seriously missed that star. I, I got so fixated on the bullet bill that I was like ready to pivot for that. All right, looks like we're both getting the Mega Mushroom, lots of lag. And Machatino bullets me. And there goes all my mushrooms. All right, we got the box. Good thing it's only lap one. Good thing it's only the first GP of the tournament. Oh, I almost failed that. Way too close for combo. Should I go for a shortcut? Oh, we got it. Let's go. I almost failed that. I don't even know if I want to go for that again. I feel like I need Daisy. <laughs> Just the extra speed I think would be very helpful. But the one thing I do love about Bowser Jr. is... He's tiny, so you can see easier in the Mega Mushrooms. Oh, scary. Threats everywhere, and that's the game mode in general. Okay, playing pretty cautious. It's working out. Staying away from the bombs. It's gonna be a shock used any second, of course. That sucks. I I used my mushroom trying to get to that bullet in time. It did not register, and instead we paid the price. But I'll get this Mega Mushroom, and we'll get the Shock too. I don't know if I can go off that. I think I need to do this. Rough race for me. Got the POW, nice. I really needed a bullet. And I'm looking at the minimap, and I mean, 6th and 5th are right there, and I'm just trying to get to at least 30 points. 60 would be great, and that would be the goal, but 90 is pretty much impossible. So as long as we maintain, like, in, like, 5th or 6th every race, we'll get to 60. Oh, Mega Mushroom's gone, right in front of my eyes. Bad. No item. Well, the item probably would have just been a mushroom, so that's okay. But this one I'm gonna grab. I think I'm gonna go for a shortcut. No, I don't have enough. I'm just gonna slow down instead. Yes, got fifth. Hey, forgot blue shell on the line. He might have finished. I'm not sure. But wow. That was a tough race. Got my bonus, 31 points after the first four races. I'm on pace to get over 60, not bad. And who is in a lot of trouble? Normie and Zialot, Rage God, just barely saved. Double elimination, four races to go. I seriously keep losing to a Blue Falcon, and I ain't even mad. Machutino, a legend out here. And uh, I mean, it kind of makes sense that I keep losing to a Blue Falcon, considering, I mean, Roxy and Machutino are both putting up some numbers with this thing, so, you know, double reason not to be mad and if there's two good blue falcon players it doubles my chances of losing to a blue falcon every race so i should i should just get used to losing to blue falcons at this point not something i'm used to having happen in mario kart but item rain uh is proving to be unpredictable as per usual and that's what i love about it i think i can get to this oh i'll take the bullet though i was gonna go for the mega mushroom but the bullet was definitely the play so i'm feeling extremely nice and safe about these next four the fact i already have 31 and i feel like this has been a less than optimal start gives me a lot of hope for uh this back half of this GP to get to 60 and enter the serious part of the tournament in a uh, nice situation having two bonuses up my sleeve. Go for the mushroom chaining here. Beautiful. I am just going to chill over here and stay away from everyone. Jeez. Right? In second now. And this is... Oh, Roxy. Oh! Oh my gosh. It's one of those tracks where when you get ahead, you can break away on this track like so much more than the average one on item rain. It, it just... You have just so many options. And with options, come shock dodges. So I'm just looking at first, and it looks like it's dicey with a mile and a half breakaway. But that Dry Bones player... It's not too far from us. 
Machatino gets wrecked. Amazing. I will ditch the Mega Thundercloud for the Bullet Bill any day of the week. I'm hoping this bullet can get me to third place. That's not third. All right, fourth place, I'll take it. 39, 20 more to go, 21 more to go, and Roxy has 59. I just noticed Roxy had 59. I thought Mpex was in first. I have not even been looking at the top. Wow, anything can happen on this one. And it's another one where you can really break away. So I'm just gonna try to get in first, really get that first power item. Great, oh, that sucks. There goes my advantage. Yes, no, we got to the star. How did I get to that star? For everyone. Unbelievable. Well, it looks like Roxy was going for a different strategy. And I think, yeah, it looks like I was able to connect. Come on! This is happening too much. But hey, it's only GP1, so I can't get too upset. But wow. I'm upset. <laughs> uh. Oh. Oh! This is... I'm just falling out of it. I need this. Okay, okay. At least we split it. That's good. We're getting to that Mega Mushroom. And I'm still going to try to play like a shot can happen any second. Because a shot can happen. Yeah, any second. <laughs> so I try to avoid things even though I'm in a Mega, unlike normal play. Really, really trying to find a bullet here. They're just everywhere. Okay, okay. This is bad race. Very bad. Guess I'll use this. That's good. Oh my god, oh my god. Yes, we're finding all the good items. There we go. Found a bullet. I'm in the bullet. All right, let's see where this can get me to. I'm thinking get me to fifth place. Get me past the Funky Kongs, and then from there, oh, that's kind of awkward. I'll go for the star, I guess. There could be a, sh yeah, there it is. Yes, we needed that. All right, you know what? Fifth place is good, but wow. It's actually insane how far we're falling behind from Blue Falcon players. Like, Blue Falcons are dominating item rain. It feels like a Blue Falcon is gonna win this, and I can't believe I'm saying that. More bonuses being awarded here. Oh my gosh, and we have 46 points. 14 more in two races. We can do it. And let's look at the bottom of the leaderboard. We have Rage God and Charmander just barely safe over Normie, and Ziala is in a lot of trouble. Mpex is on the spear. I feel like Mpex is gonna win this one. Granted, Blue Falcon, pretty fast vehicle, but it also can't wheelie. Can I get a draft? Yes, that is what we needed. I just need a first place to shake off all of the tormenting that happened this GP from all the bombs that dropped in my face. Almost got that, but not quite. And I'm gonna go wide. Never mind. I'm already paying the price. Perfect. We're banana hopping. Ouch. Charmander's gonna get to that, right? Normie, oh! Okay, it looks like we're getting the bullet bill. There's so many bullet bills. Adam Green is so intense. I forget how intense every single race is. Oh, yes, needed that. I just use my mushrooms immediately on this one. Yes. Okay, there goes. Okay, well at least I got the mega mushroom. Beautiful. Got the mega mushroom. Looks like I'm gonna be getting third place. And I see a blue falcon in fourth, and that was a nice one. I'm kind of realizing this is such a tough item rain room. One of the toughest I've played in, because I feel like some races where I'm not even making any mistakes, I'm still falling pretty far behind first. Looks like Mpex gets another bonus, and oh my gosh, Normie and Rage God are tied going into the last race. Charmander is not safe. 
this is gonna be crazy. Luigi Raceway is always a challenge. I need my four points, I need that second bonus. I need to remember not to accidentally hold down L and use a bonus on accident. A lot to remember here. Most importantly, I wanna get in first, so I get the good items. Get first dibs on the good items. Nope, got greened. There goes everything. Oh, Mega Mushroom. We're back in it. <laughs> Emotional roller coaster here, as per usual. Managed to snag that. Beautiful. Gonna get back to the mainland. And hit the booster. Watch out for Hafer. I'll try to red him as all oh, the Mega Mushroom. Wow, it did not work. Red Shell evaporated <laughs> into thin, thin air. I, I don't think there's any point in even throwing reds forward almost on item rain when that happens. It's qu qu I mean, it's quite funny because you throw a red, you don't know what's going to happen. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, <laughs> red is reliable. But in Mario Kart Wii, especially Mario Kart Wii item rain, it's like the worst item. All right, that's fine. We got a booster here. <laughs> Never mind. This sucks. We're going to lose a lot of time here. No way we're going to be in second. Never mind. I'm surprised. Not too many people dodging these shocks. And the good items are just falling right into my lap. I hope I have some good luck on the back half of the tournament. Because this GP has been great for me. Just got to get a first place. Oh, there's Charmander. Oh, Charmander does not want to get out on the first GP. Don't blame him. Mega, throwing the mushroom. There was a star pretty far out of the way. There's Roxy, of course. I'm just gonna use this mushroom and definitely get this mega. And get this mega, why not? I'll throw a bomb back on the last booster and it looks like it connected and it took out the Funky Kong. Let's go. Oh my gosh. And the results are in. What a close finish. And Rage God, who was safe the entire time, just barely falls out of it. Normie and Charmander survive. Ziala also out. We have the final 10. GP2, here we go. Don't wanna get bombed. Yes. Oh, I didn't get the Mega Mushroom. I knew it was there. I just couldn't exactly think. Well, that would have been really hard to reach. I'm already noticing it is a much smoother experience. And that's probably because we went from 12 players to 10. So I cannot wait for next GP when we have a whopping 6. So, I mean, this GP is going to be extremely, extremely difficult. Every point is going to count. We're not going to feel safe until it is mathematically impossible for us to get eliminated. And... Gotta start strong. Luckily, we have a breakaway. I'm pulling good items. I gotta start hunting for the bullet bills, too. The second place gets a bullet, it lasts forever. Oh, just missed that by pixels. But there is a Mega Mushroom falling right into my lap. Okay, gonna have to hit the wall to get the Mega. Worth it, I think. Just have a little bit of breakaway. We're definitely going for this. Yes! Got the dodge, got the Mega. That did not work out very well, though. But we're gonna get the star. Sam, 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 Sam. Good. That's funny. All right, me and Hafer are getting trolled right now, which is really funny. I'm okay being in second. A lot happening here. I'm not going to get the Mega, though. There's a star. The pow that we saw that we didn't hit, and just like that, we're in first. Pow ended up screwing over first place. Got really fortunate with the pow. That is so bad for me. Okay, that actually helped me so much. Empex was about to squish me and ruin my entire race. And instead, I think I just got target shocked. Yes, we're back in first. What a sequence. What a sequence. I need this first. I really need this first. Of course, I slip drift. Of course. You know what? Mpex deserves this. Mpex, well played. 
Mpex getting first place with the Jet Setter. That was funny. 12 points, still have a good point distribution for 10. Nine players has a really rough point distribution. So we're going with this format, 2442 or 2441 for the eliminations. Is Mpex gonna be able to get another first place with the Jet Setter? Let's see, he's starting in first. And he's gonna get the bullet. Matutino got the bullet instead. Insanity. It's crazy how good automatic is in item rain. Like, you wouldn't guess it, but it actually is, like, viable. We're seeing some ridiculous combos on automatic proving to be viable on this game mode, where they're not viable on regular 150. So, it's quite nice. It's quite nice. Let's get rid of Matutino. <laughs> Great spot. So happy with that lap one. So long as bombs aren't falling on my face, I'm happy. I prefer the bullets. Let's see. Whenever shocks happen, I actually have time to look around since we're moving so slow. And Dags is probably going to get that star. And Matutino squishes me! Oh no. I actually never noticed that ramp over there. That's funny. On the right, I just noticed that for the first time. That's so funny. Throwing this back. Oh, gonna grab this. This is awkward design, but we're dealing with it. I remember it from a past video. Finally got a bullet. There are so many bullets that I see right as I'm passing them. And I know I don't have time to go back since these rooms are so competitive. No! Oh my gosh. Need to get this there no I missed the bullet on the right oh okay no one's passed me on a bullet that's good I'm not getting that that's so bad now my angles all off and now I'm running into this are you serious this is just the worst all right, well, I'm gonna get bailed out by the shock and I'll take it. I'll take anything I can get right now. I'll blue shot myself at the line. That was a tough race. I had so many moments that were extremely frustrating and I feel like I'm not even that good at that track in general, let alone on item rain. Six points, 18, 12 more to get the bonus. For this track, I really need to get a star. You can do the giant shortcut and then the rest is history. Just hope a star shows up on my lap. You know what? There it is. <laughs> Got the star. Got the shortcut! Let's go! And just like that, we have a breakaway. I love this track on Item Rain. One of my favorites. Okay. I'm gonna lay a sneaky fake item box. Oh, that's a, that's a miracle. I didn't fall off right there. I'm hitting a bullet in first. It feels amazing. And the bullet did not lead me off the edge and for a moment I thought it was going to. So, I mean, I still need to get a first place today. I feel like I haven't even gotten one. I've gotten some second places, but first place is what we need to get bonuses. And we need to accumulate as many bonuses as possible. It's going to get really difficult. Like, I'm really curious what's gonna happen on the back half of the room when we have people like Matutino and Mpex, and are they gonna be memeing me still using Blue Falcon and Jet Setter on automatic, or are we gonna actually see a shift? I'm not sure, but I'm interested to find out. And regardless, <laughs> if they stay on their carts, it is very possible that we end up losing, and I just got the shortcut again, so. I've just already won this race, I feel like. Yeah, I just dodged in first, like, <laughs> I'm lapping dicey! I almost never lap people online, this is great. Well, I don't think it's gonna last for long, but oh my gosh, what a race for me. It's one of my best item rain races. And 
that shortcut is a little broken. I think it was in Super Circuit though, in a different way, like a bouncy pad that you can spring off of. Super Circuit just had some really broken shortcuts, so it is funny to see them in this game as well. So, incredible race, sub two minutes, doesn't get better than that, and I was due for that, honestly. We got our bonus, not even halfway through the GP, and we are the point leader, feeling great. And it looks like Hafer just barely ahead of Trimander, quadruple elimination, lots more Mario Kart to play. One away from max amount of bonuses. And gotta keep putting on the pressure. I'm not safe yet. I mean, I only have 30, 30 something points after three races, five races to go. Definitely a few more good ones. I feel like 40 plus. And even then, I wouldn't feel safe. These point distributions can be complete whack in this game, as you know. So I, you never feel safe unless you're at the top, top. And that's gotta be a one or two races left. It can be 30 point swing in two races if bad things happen with first and last, so you're never safe in this game. And then go for a shortcut. No items at all. It feels like a non-item rain room right now with how little items I'm seeing on the beach. Like, where are the good items at? Where are they? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm not getting the Mega Mushroom. Ah! Oh! These items are falling right into my lap. One of them landed on me, that felt great. And then that one, I just looked to the side and there it is. Beautiful. I'm gonna get the star. Amazing. I can win this one now. I just saw a star disappear, I was gonna go for it. Glad I didn't. Use my mushroom. Still don't have this one locked up yet. The pow dodge. And dry bones. Got hit at the line. We're safe now. We're good. It feels amazing. But got four more races left to play. I can aim for 90 points at this point. I just need 12 more points and I max out of bonuses, so. I'm just gonna try to actually remember not to use my bonuses. That's the only thing I could do wrong at this point. <laughs> use, click the L button. That's the only mistake I can make. I'm getting trampled, but ah! Never mind. I was gonna, but a bullet bill fell right into my lap, and nope, it was gone. Roxy is really impressive, though. The amount of points putting up using the Blue Falcon, and I mean Machatino like hanging in there. I'm loving it. I'm very impressed. And also, just bring in the hype. Like, it's fun when the people who are the regulars on this channel in the tournaments mix it up and showcase an alternative set of skills. And some players do that very often, and others treat us with it once in a while. Regardless, makes for a good time. I'm gonna use this, and I'm going to get this beautiful bullet bill. But I'm looking at the mini-map and I'm not winning this one. There's already some people breaking away. But I'm hoping I can get third place. Third looks doable. No! Oh, my race is pretty much done. Let's just get away from everyone. Let's get this. All right, all right, let's see. Wait, wait, wait. we can salvage this one second. We're getting another Mega Mushroom. That's amazing. Oh my gosh. Why? Oh, that was so bad. That was so bad. Oh, seven. All right, seven. You know what? That's okay. I'm still gonna get a few points for that. Oh, let's see what we're at. 50 points. I need 10 more in the next three races. Oh no, right on me. Okay, got it. That's good. And there was one disconnection, it appears, which means it's gonna be triple elimination after the next three races. Oh, don't wanna give this to Roxy. Nice try, Roxy. Oh! Roxy's too good. And Roxy goes so wide that I can't even catch him. Oh my.
I connected the bomb on Roxy, it looks like. Oh my gosh, that was crazy. Gonna get this item, because I'm in the middle spot. Gonna try to bomb Dags here. Ah, it looks like it didn't connect. I really thought that was gonna work. Okay, well, we're getting one of the Mega Mushrooms. And a star. And I feel like a dodge is imminent. Where is it? Never mind. I'm getting this. I'm getting this. It's worth it. Come on. Okay, well, I'm the one getting the shock. No! Yes! Bullet Bill. Amazing. Amazing. And wow, top three really broke away. I don't mean it's so funny. Sometimes the blue shells don't even work, and then the top players just break away so far. It's such a stupid game mode. This is the goofiest game mode ever. It feels better to be playing Item Rain not in a tournament series. The tournament series, you know, there's a lot on the line. Trying to win with these various vehicle combinations, it gets so hype at the end. And then obviously the Imitational, the culmination of 10 plus days of Mario Karting. So, oh, I missed the bullet bill. You know, it, overall it feels, uh, feels good to play a more casual, just one-off tournament. See how things shake out. Damn shock dodge. This is a great race. This is a phenomenal race. Gotta get to the ground items before they disappear. I like to mushroom towards items. I'm always afraid, like, it's happened so many times where an item disappears a frame or two before I hit it. So I'm always expecting it to happen at this point. Oh, okay. Didn't get the shock. If I low trick that, I might have been able to hit it. Oh, and well made ramp. Even though I wasn't able to use half the boost, still able to get enough speed to make it over the jump on 150 with ease. Even on 50 CC, you can make that work. Oh yes, all right, so kind of funny to end things hitting a shock on the ground. I am officially at four bonuses, so I do not even need to use any more of my bonuses for quite a while here, hopefully. And 65 points, point leader, everything is great right now. The scariest part of this track for me is the last ramp with no glider. I had it happen so many times when this track first came out <laughs> where I would just accidentally end up flying off the edge since the ramp sends you up and I would go off the left of it and well there's no landing area over there so ended up falling off the edge so many times on this track gonna maximize invincibility time and gonna hit this bullet bill first place is right there this will not last long but it's gonna get me past Charmander and it's gonna get me to first with an item sometimes item rain just goes your way and other times it doesn't, and you want to quit the game mode forever, and it feels helpless, and you feel like whoever invented this game mode needs to change it immediately, needs to be, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> but overall, I think the number one thing I would change about Item Rain would be just to make it so the screen doesn't shake when the bombs are on the screen, because that gets a little jarring. But overall, I think it's good to embrace the chaos and not take it too seriously, but it is easier said than done, because... Mario Kart is the most rage-inducing, stressful game ever. Okay, we're, we're grabbing this, we're grabbing this. I'm trying to, like, play a little slower and just get the items more, but... It's hard. Easier said than done, for sure, because once you pass an item, it's really tough to decide if it's even worth going for the item behind you. That was incredible. That was incredible. That was not incredible. Okay, well actually that was pretty incredible that Charmander didn't Mega Me. I was definitely expecting it. Still in third, despite that. Oh, Blue Shell. Yes, yes. This is just a free race for me. I already have my four bonuses. Just relaxing, doesn't matter what place I get. I do affect the rest of the race, so that's the only thing that matters. 
We are not falling off. We are not getting hit by a bomb in the air at the end. And everything is A-OK. -okay. Just like that, Normie is out. And we have one race left to get to the final six. So two players out after Yoshi Circuit. And you know what? I'm kind of happy I get to play a nice, peaceful, calm Yoshi Circuit race. Oh, triple bomb. I love how I just said that and there's bombs everywhere. It's like, ah, ah, what, what? I just clipped the edge and it just sent me off so slowly. I should have used another mushroom. I ran out of mushroom boost on the very last piece of pixel, like for the grass edge, and I just had my back wheel clip it and the rest was history. But we are getting all the mushrooms and we're going for the tunnel. No, what is this lap? Everything is going wrong. This is so funny. Good thing this race doesn't matter because, oh my God, if this race mattered, the Wii would have been powered off. Oh, I'm, I'm getting that shock, I'm mad. Some nice maneuvering, if I don't say so myself. Professional Mario Carter lines. And we're getting the bullet bill. We needed that bullet bill. I'm looking at the minimap. This Daisy has a 20 second lead over me. And Dry Bones and Baby Mario are the Blue Falcon, so I have no excuse being this far behind. And we are not getting the item. We're probably gonna get hit right, yep. I almost got hit by Dicey. I really had to be careful there. And instead we're dodging. Okay, we're back in it now. We're really back in it. I gotta use this. I can't be playing around. Let's see if this takes me... Oh, that really didn't take me very far. I'm kind of disappointed in that. Not gonna lie. I'm using this and I'm getting hit again. Balls, dags. Both laps. Jeez. Unbelievable. Let's get the item. Beautiful. Get the mushroom. Stand the pal, get them on the difficult section. And you know what, at least I got the Mega Mushroom before I got destroyed. I'm gonna get hit again, yeah, I already knew that. And I need to get this Bullet Bill here. I'm in last place right now. I think this Bullet Bill will get me to seventh or sixth, but I have a starter chain. Okay, it's getting me to sixth, beautiful. Oh my God, it's getting me past the U-turn? Yes, I'm in fourth, I dodged! Throwing the blue shell. It get connected, ah! <laughs> Third. Get wrecked. This was such a great GP. I can't even wait to see how many points I got. And Dicey and Balls Dags, who kept hitting me that race, eliminated. Final six, quadruple elimination. This is gonna be a bloodbath. Concord Town, one of my favorite tracks. And I should start using bonuses before I get to 30 points. That is a must, considering I'm already at max. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Terrible start. I'll even consider using bonuses on this race. First race is very important. And I'm already getting squished twice on the very first lap of the first race of the next GP. Not how I envision this going, considering how last GP went. Incredible. Okay, well, never mind. This is going better now. I'm gonna save this for the shortcut, and then I'll be set. There we go. I think it'll drop me in third or second. It's definitely not taking me to first. Oh, yes. So happy I held my bullet bill. And I'm getting rewarded by getting another one. We have six different characters in the final six. And we have 60 FPS here. It's gonna be a beautiful time. Beautiful. Never mind. not beautiful. I did not even know there was a mushroom there. The blooper totally screwed me over but I will get the star on the ground, and thank you very much. Hopefully I get a dodge. Even better. Yes, got the blooper. Oh, star's pretty nice as well. I'm catching ya. Oh, I gotta be careful, gotta slow down. I don't wanna hit that at full speed, cause then the bullet would probably fall off the edge. I don't wanna risk it. All right, the bullet did not connect. I'm gonna get the chain. I am gonna be very careful. Wow, that was an incredible throw. That would have hit me. I had to slow down to uh, about 10 MPH to <laughs> survive. Honestly, I spammed that just to get away from the bomb. 
How did I get that? That was amazing. I am completely happy with second. I'm just very, very blessed that that bullet did not hit me. Because at that point, who knows what could have happened? Do you know how Adam Rain is? All right, the results are gonna be in and the point distribution is gonna be awful, but you get 10 points per second, which is still a lot. So really, really good. Third place would have been horrifying. Six points for third, that's not it. <laughs> it should be at least seven. This track, I struggle to see the yellow items. It's not my favorite item rain track, but I do enjoy it. I actually really like this one on 200cc. Yes. I dare you to hit this ball. I dare you. There we go. It's funny how the bullets are not even that good when you're in first place. Like sometimes they can be amazing still and other times they're completely useless and they can actually <laughs> throw you off the edge. But the good thing about getting a bullet bill when you're in first is just so the other players don't get it. Alright, saw the yellow star. Beautiful. Saw another star on a roll right now. That was a little bit risky. A little bit riskier than usual right now. I think it's because last GP went so well. This is okay. I'm going to get the star and we'll be back in business immediately. Yeah, still in third. I'll take it. And oh! It made me think at the worst time. I was slowing down on purpose so I can get the Mega Mushroom, but that did not happen. Oh, that's a pretty good respawn. I'll take it. And oh, <laughs> if that respawn we just one millisecond earlier, I was going to get trampled. But we're good. Poor item box. And fourth out of six right now. No! This is so frustrating. All right, we'll get this mushroom. And that's a golden. That sucks. I thought it was a star. Doesn't matter anyway. I'm getting bombed. I, what, what was that sequence? <laughs> I don't know. I'm so far behind. Should probably grab it. I think I could get fourth still. I have a star in inventory. Let's see. Let's see. All right. Well, the bullet actually takes pretty stupid lines. That was that was a brutal race. I'm in a lot of trouble now. I only have ten points after two races, and this is just going to be a final two. So I am three points behind right now. That's what I got to focus on. Second place is the goal for everyone. This race, I will start using bonuses, probably at least one, maybe even more. It's so important I don't fall far, far behind second place. Try to steals the bullet bill. All right, some great chains happening. I really needed that. Oh, it's gonna drop me here? Are you serious? All right, well, at least I'm getting a Mega. I'm getting the dodge. I'm getting another Mega Mushroom and the low trick! Oh, that was an amazing sequence. Yes! Okay, this is what we needed, ladies and gentlemen. This is what we needed. I need a good item to fall down right now. Because using my item, my bonus will just give me a Mushroom at best. That's not a low trick. That sucks. There's no items. Like, ah. <laughs> it's unfortunate. I'm gonna go for this. Because I finally found something. It took forever. Alright, we're getting that. That's good. This bullet's going a while. Unlike my bullet. Yes. Yes. Did not get the bullet. There's another bullet. I'm just going to do shortcut and forget about the bullets. There's a star, but I missed it. I'm saving this mushroom to mushroom into an item that I need. Chain it here, actually. That's a star. That's not a star. It's gone. Chaining this mushroom. Or, use, I mean, using this mushroom. All right, we're not in first anymore. That's okay. All right, got a mega. Good. 
such a close race. Double star. This is a stupid race. Okay, we can't go for shortcut, but we can go for this bullet bill, and my whole race depends on this bullet. Oh! The bullet did the shortcut! Go, bullet, go, go, go! Can't the bullet go all the way? Yes! That's so amazing. I think I got second. Oh my gosh, so instead of being like nine points, or like seven points behind, I'm one point ahead, and I'm in second overall. We're fighting Roxy and L right now, our main competition. Hafer is just broken away. Another terrifying race. And once again, another track that is so heavily reliant on off-road, yet there are no off-road vehicles in this room. So no mock bikes, sorry, no Magic Cruisers, no Dolphin Dashers to worry about. It's just going to be a <laughs> slugfest to get these items way in the off-road, but I think we'll be okay. Oh, this is amazing. It's taking me a long ways. <laughs> that was amazing. I did not expect it to last that long. And we got the blooper. I'm getting another bullet bill. <laughs> Still haven't. Oh gosh. I'm using a bonus. First one has been activated and it was an amazing one. I'm using another one. Yes! Because I'm just gonna hold this. This is an amazing situation here. Got the shock! That was amazing. So I, I burned two bonuses, but this race is so important. I need to get top two. There's Roxy in first place, my main competition. Roxy might try to slow down and hit me right now. I gotta be very cautious. I'm not even going for the item. I'm going for that star. Got the dodge! Oh. Here I am, keeping of a blue falcon, and I'm losing, but Roxy is gonna get blue shoved. Feels great. Nope, Roxy dodged. Roxy is so good, jeez. I don't think that was good hitting the bullet. The bullet's going really wide. I think I can win. Yes, first. Oh, I needed that so bad. That's 15 versus 10. That's a 10 point swing right there. And what a battle. I mean, Roxy is just doing the impossible right here with the Blue Falcon. Roxy, I think won the first GP with the Blue Falcon. Definitely got top two. And I mean, I'm catching Hafer. 13 points behind. I can still get first. And I burned two bonuses, but I got one back. So we're at three now. I did not want to burn out. That was not the plan. Not the plan. <sighs> okay, that's fine. There's a boost panel. At least we're going to pull some good items. Just got to be really careful. Of the bombs. <laughs> you have to be so far away from them. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. So scary. Scary game mode. Item Rain brings out the real fear. Yes! Yes! And I did not get hit by the bullet bill because of it. Instead, I'm the one pulling all the power. Let's go. And there's Roxy once again, my competition. Roxy could catch up in no time. We have to really put the pressure on. I gotta use this so I don't get mega. Yes, I'm gonna get the star. Oh. It is crazy how good automatic can be on item rain. But I feel like automatic will suffer the most in a situation where there's only two players because there's gonna be so much less uh, getting hit by things when there's less players. It's a lot more getting all the good items on the ground. And I feel like I don't know, I feel like the, the jankiness of automatic <laughs> carts is you end up just, you, you end up getting items that these other vehicles can't get, and all the inside drift vehicles taking relatively the same lines, and outside drift takes a totally different path. But when there's only two vehicles left, things are a little bit different, so. I don't know, all I'm saying is I'd be very, very surprised if a Blue Falcon won this tournament. 
even with the incredible Blue Falcon performances, I'd still be very surprised. But I mean, hey, the fact... I think I won that. The fact that Much Creeps won the Item Rain Tournament with the Sugar Scoot means anything is possible. And it's a shame we don't have Much Creeps in this tournament right here. I'm sure if we do more of these, we'll get Much Creeps back in the Item Rain mix of things. I actually got first. This is incredible. Now I'm only one point behind Hafer, and most importantly, 15 points ahead of Roxy. But I'm not safe yet, so <sighs> gotta race my heart out. Machatino is out with the Blue Falcon. An admirable sixth place made it to the back half of the tournament. Sunset Wilds. Okay. Ouch. I get this. It's crazy having 50 points and this going so well. Yet not feeling safe at all. I will not feel safe until it is mathematically impossible for me to get eliminated. <laughs> Yes. No. No. Item Rain sometimes decides it wants you to win, and other times that happens. I uh, shouldn't have went for that. Roxy takes me out. I should probably use this. Ouch. That actually worked out. There we go. My bonus golden made W's out of it. <laughs> and now I'm using this bullet bill. Only five in the room now, gotta remember that. Changes the item distribution a little bit and double bam shock dodge, amazing. This is worth it. Yes. Roxy just got bombed. Oh, I almost got that. I almost got that. Okay, that, that's really far away. I'm not going to go for that shock. Someone might go for it, though. Beautiful, beautiful. There it is. I'm not going to get first, though. This Daisy player just really broke away. Yeah, the... <laughs> It's really funny, like, how much... Okay, that was still good. That was that was still really good. I'm gonna get second here. Second place. Can't be too upset with that. Very soon, it's gonna be over. I don't think I mathematically am safe yet. However, Charmander, the last Wee Wheeler remaining, eliminated in fifth place. Great performance, and we love to see Charmander in these rooms. In first place overall now. This is feeling amazing, but it's not over yet. Let's see how this goes. Still gotta get my bonus items. I think mathematically, pretty much safe. Unless I get like bottom two, back to back, then maybe something can happen. But most importantly, I need to focus on getting these bonuses. And just gotta get one more. Feel, oh, I did not mean to release that me turbo, but I will get this mega mushroom. Hey, first, gonna a little lead over us now. That is okay. We're gonna do the shortcut. Avoid the bomb, avoid the red. Stay locked in. Mushroom in first. And getting the trick out of the cannon. Chaining mushroom into ground shock. I mean, the ground shocks are just the most incredible feeling and I feel like I've gotten an abundance of the ground shocks today. I'm going for it. Please don't disappear. Thank you, thank you. Amazing shortcut. I can't believe I'm not in first after all of this. Getting that for sure. Sneaky bomb. Looks like it's not gonna connect. Bam. Dropping you right in front of the items. This bullet knows what's up. Overall, incredible bullet bills today. Can't complain. I'm doing a good job of staying out of the center of the road as well which is of the utmost importance. Going for a sneaky bomb throw. And, oh, no, I thought it would give me the, the mega mushroom, it did not. It's kind of a rough one, I'm using this. Yes, got the bullet. I don't think first is doable, but second definitely is. 
Okay, the bullet automatically drops me. That sucks. Great pull, great pull. Needed that. Yes, this is good for us. This is really good. But we're not getting first, but this will help me get second place. Never mind, I forgot. I should have actually probably... Nah, I might have lost it. Waiting would have been a little too risky, I think. <laughs> Second! <laughs> I went backwards and surrendered so much time and it ended up paying off. Just like that, we are at 68 points, but oh my gosh, this is insane. Hafer is in third place and he had 51 points at one point when he was like 30 points ahead. So uh, this is gonna come down to the wire. I actually think it's a really cool feature how Mr. Bean has it when players get mathematically eliminated, they're out of it. Cause that keeps people from trolling when they get out and like affecting the game in ways where, you know, they might like have a little more of a bias and when they're already out, it can, you know, get perpetuated a bit more. So it, it's a good thing overall, just for the, just for the fact that that happens and they go to spectator mode. And I think it's also kind of hype seeing people individually get eliminated instead of just seeing four people getting eliminated at the same time. It's like, okay, this player's out of this race. And then this player's out at the next race. And, you know, I mean, we're at a Final Four right now. So we have plenty of races playing in a Final Four environment. And this format, I'm really liking it. I feel like it's good. The first GP is all about, you know, stocking up your bonuses. And then the real fun begins on GP2. So definitely going to try this format more often. It's been a success so far. And it works with the system that we have on CTGP. And by system, I mean that, uh, you know, you have to have the finals be a final two. There's no way to do a final three for the finale with the way the GP mode knockout system works. So with that in mind, I think this is the best way we could think of for how to do it. Got the shock. Yeah, this race doesn't matter, but it's still gonna be fun. Just gotta practice this track. Go, 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 star! I'm still in last. But I'm getting the bloopers. That's good. Can I get third, please? Alright, we're getting last. I mean, props to everyone that race. Played so well. Such a close finish. I end up getting first, 69 points. Roxy survives, and then L gets third. Hafer goes home with fourth place. So L Hafer eliminated. It's myself versus Roxy in the finals. Good luck to Roxy, who is using Dry Bones, Blue Falcon. What an incredible combo. I thought about using Outside Drift, and then I remembered the Invitational, where I did so well, and then I went Outside Drift, and then Much Creeps destroyed me. So instead, I'm like, you know what? I feel like Roxy would feel definitely more accomplished if they got the dub against Mock Bike using Blue Falcon. And I know if I use Blue Falcon, I'm gonna lose. Oh! Three bonuses here. All right. Yes! Gotta get this. This might not even take me very far. Yeah, it's doing nothing. And then he's gonna get the bullet. And I'm gonna get the bullet! This is insane. This is insane. Oh. I'm getting this mega mushroom and I'm gonna get the bullet. Come on, bullet, come on. I don't know if it's gonna be enough. Roxy, you're so good. Played so well and lost. This is gonna be tough, guys. This is gonna be tough. All right, one zero. You gotta win five. Three bonuses and might start using it after this first box. Let's try to get the first power item. That was a bullet. Okay. Mega mushroom. 
More Mega Mushrooms. More me oh, that's a bullet. We're absolutely grabbing that bullet. And we have a bomb in inventory. I'm gonna hold it out. Got a bullet bill in the bullet bill. And I'm looking at the mini map. It looks like a failed shortcut just happened. Great for us. We're chaining Mega Mushrooms. I'm grabbing this bullet so Roxy can't get it, but it's so close right now. Pretty scary. All right. Amazing. This should get me there. I'm good, I'm good. Such a short track, and it all came down to Roxy failing the shortcut, and that lost a lot of time. We were able to get the W one to one. Four more wins to go. Still sitting pretty with my three bonus items. Feeling a lot better after getting that win. That was a track I was extremely worried about. Oh, especially Mario Circuit 1. That's another one. Anything can happen. But this is a track that I have much better chance of winning on. Considering we can do the Shroomless Shortcut. And I feel like Roxy is not going to be going for that on Blue Falcon. Granted, Roxy is already pulling off the impossible here. So who knows? Who knows at this point? All right. Shortcut time. Very important moment. Just saw a bullet bill. But the shortcut is actually better for me to go for, for sure. And I could not even get the trick boost because I was on the far right side. But we're chilling. I'm gonna leave that bullet bill for Roxy, keep it interesting. <laughs> no, that bullet would not last long. It is really comical how bad the bullet bills are when you're in first. But that is one of my favorite things about the 1v1 on Iron Man. Like, 1v1 on Iron Man is actually a lot of fun. All right? Not great, but we still have a lead. And if I could get the shortcut again, Roxy's in a lot of trouble. I got it, yes! I just barely got that, I really did. I was not sure about that one. The key is to jump trick, because then you get a little more air, and that is so helpful on that one. Get some weird lines. Roxy's right on my tail. It's such a close race. Got exactly what I needed. Had to be very careful about that bomb. All right, shortcut time. Terrifying, gotta start the end. Oh my gosh, Roxy was right there. And oh, I did not get the uh, drift off. And I had a terrible angle, but I'm happy I didn't crash into the wall because that would have been much worse of a problem. All right, two to one. This is not over. Another Mario circuit. And I just burned out. I'm using a bonus. It's a mega and it just went bye-bye. <laughs> it's horrible. All right, the mushroom helped, but Roxy got the bullet and I got another mushroom. No! It's gonna be two to two, just like that. I don't even want to burn a bonus if I'm being honest. I'm just gonna go forward. There's bullets everywhere. Gotta get that one. Okay. I'm not that far behind. It's not over. Yeah, bullet lasts forever when you're in second place. We're back in it. We're back in it. Just gotta keep getting these stars. It is absurd how Roxy is this good with a vehicle that horrific. I mean, I am inspired to use the Blue Falcon, if I'm being honest. I'm going backwards for this thing because I clearly can't drive this track, so I might as well just have the bullet bill do it for me. And I am so far behind, it's gonna be pretty tough for me to win this. All right, that's, that's good, needed that. I'm not gonna, yeah, it's over. That's fine. Well played, Roxy. Roxy's dominating the Mario circuits. Roxy got hit on the line, but it's over. And uh, the lesson to be had here is do not burn out on item rain, especially in a 1v1. It is not 
the ideal strategy. Trust me. Still at three bonuses. Not burning out this time. That's good. Instead, we have Roxy burning out. Let's go. Let's go. Took a page out of my book. <laughs> uh, I'm going to grab that. Got the star too. Beautiful. <laughs> Roxy is having the worst start ever. I'm looking at the mini minimap map, and this is comical. Just bomb after bomb after bomb, I guess. And is not even moving at this point. I'm a little worried. This might be a uh, controller run out of bat. Oh, no, no. Moving again. Okay. But uh, very confusing. And Roxy dodges. This is definitely not over. I got to stop looking at the minimap. I just need to focus and not worry about what's going on with Roxy. But did not expect to get this big of a breakaway. And it's 2-2 two to two especially. Like, this is an extremely important race. I get the star. Keep chain of stars. Beautiful. Bullet Bill. Enjoy that, Roxy. I'll enjoy the shock dodging. Let's go. And I really wish the item set was here. It just bothers me. I'm too used to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. And this is definitely the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe talking about. Nice. Got the low trick. And ouch. And I mean, Roxy is 15 seconds behind. But I mean, anything can happen in item rain. Especially if multiple bombs hit me and then a bullet bill of some sort that lasts forever. So, gonna keep grabbing the bullet bills. That's Roxy's main way of coming back. Stars and goldens are not gonna be enough at this point. Shocks also. That's why I gotta get all the mega mushrooms. Yeah, we're looking good. We're looking good. I'm guessing Roxy just got destroyed at the beginning. Like, sometimes you do get bombed three or four times in a row in item rain. You fall 20 seconds behind at the very beginning pretty ridiculous but item rain is ridiculous game mode and i kept my bonuses and we got the w it's three to two and now <sighs> we focus on the next race because this is not over roxy's putting up a fight for calamari desert i forgot to turn on my microphone before starting the race but look how close this was this is the final lap and we are rounding the last corner i'm in first Things look okay, and then all of a sudden, Roxy comes out of nowhere and bullets me, and look at the reaction sadness all over my face, and it is for good reason too, because look at the score. Just like that, things were tied. Three to three. Here we go. Another track with surface area everywhere, and I feel like Roxy's really good at these ones, because I keep losing the flat tracks and keep winning the more crazy ones. At least we have two bonuses now. I need a mushroom here. Great. It's not great. All right, there goes the lead. All right, that's good. Need to grab this. Oh, it's gone. It's crazy how these items like fly off the side like that. You gotta be really on your toes on this one. I guess I'll block the shortcut if I can't do the shortcut and I need this star. And whenever I see Roxy stop like that, I'm afraid that they're stopping for a bullet bill. It's my biggest fear. That was a good bullet. Definitely needed that. All right. Small lead, but we'll take it. Missed the bullet. I'm going to get this. Yes. Amazing. 
I really needed that, and I just barely pulled it off. Roxy was behind me the entire time. I kept looking at the mini map. I couldn't even commentate, but we got the win. It is four to three. I need to beat this blue falcon. I cannot lose to a blue falcon. If I lose this, it goes to one more random tiebreaker race. Good luck, Roxy. I need to get this win. It'll be five to three. I have one bonus just in case I need it. That was so close. Really want to get this win with Bowser Jr. Getting all the low tricks. And there is Roxy. And I'm using this. And just like that, I lose my bonus right as I use it. Roxy gets the shock. We have our work cut out for us going into lap two. Ouch, ouch, ouch. I needed that so badly. Just gotta watch out for this thing throwing me off a random corner. Get me past this corner, please, please, please. That works, I'll take it. We're back in it now. Roxy gets that. Oh no, I'm gonna get this then. Good. All right, now we're getting some luck and I really needed that. And I got the Mega Mushroom as well. So scared right now. That's an, a very good pull. It's just not gonna be enough and Roxy gets the win. So now it is four to four and we have to play one more race. It's a tiebreaker in the finals. Number one, do not burn out. Success. Number two, get the first power item before Roxy. I stole it. Got the mega. This is insane, this is insane. <gasps> oh my gosh! I have no bonuses, but I do have the shock. And a star! So close. Oh, did not reach it up there. I'm gonna use this mushroom because I lost quite a bit of speed right there. Roxy gets the shock and luckily there's a, I didn't even hit that. I gotta use this. This is terrifying. Missed that by pixels paying the price. Not gonna hit that banana, nope. Definitely gonna grab this. So close. Oh, that's really bad. Roxy gets the Mega Mushroom in first. This is a bomb, but I don't know what I can do with this. Except throw a Hail Mary! Wow, Roxy won the entire thing with the Blue Falcon! 
Unbelievable. I try my best, but clearly I have my work cut out for me in item rain. Oh my gosh. Shouts to Roxy. I don't even know what to say. I cannot believe someone could be this good at item rain with a vehicle like that. Major props. Good games, everyone. And be sure to smash subscribe for more Mario Kart Wii knockout tournaments.